forget the day we met Your eyes are blue, me piercing through I can't forget the day we met If you don't know me, Michelle um, I am 31, just turned 31 last week Technically earlier this week But we'll say last week because it's just easier um, I am currently pregnant So I'm enjoying my mama's uh, over here um, so that I don't feel so bad about not being able to drink. Because I love me some drinks. Specifically wine. Hence the wine glass. Makes me feel fancy. And it also makes me feel fancy. Makeup. So, I have nothing else to do today, so I put my hair up in this very strange updo. And I picked up some new products today at the store. That I've, oh my gosh, I almost dropped everyone of those. I've never seen these before. And they were 97 cents each. So I was like, heck, why not give it a shot? So we're going to try them out. If they're crap, they're crap. If they're great, heck yeah, man. So we're going to see. We're going to see. Oh, and I picked up some mascara too. Because I'm like really kind of tired of using my super expensive absolute favorites um, on days like today where I'm not going to be doing anything. If I do anything else the rest of the day, it's going to be um, planting some stuff out in my garden. So why waste the expensive stuff on gardening? Try some 97 cent things. So let's get started, shall we? So I got this today. It's the In Studio Cosmetics, which I've never freaking heard of. But sorry, let me not try to do that with one hand. Duh. Okay. It's their eye primer. And I know that's like completely backwards to you guys. I'm doing this on my selfie camera because I'm just sitting in my bedroom right now. We got some new air conditioner units, and I'm literally sitting right beside one right now because. I'm pregnant and it's hot. It's hot. We're not even in the summer yet and I'm already like dying, so it's gonna be interesting. But okay. Just a normal normal dough fit. We're gonna see how this goes. It's pretty liquidy. I really don't mind because I have dry eyes, dry eyelids, so I don't mind it. I always like to put a little bit underneath my eyes too. I don't know if anybody else does that. Do I else do that? Do I else do that? I do that. Okay. I don't know if you can see it. Not primed, primed. It's not a big difference, but I mean, it covers up the red, which is nice. And kind of hydrating. Like, this stuff's 97 cents, so there's not a whole lot of information on the packaging for it. I didn't look them up online to see if there was any information that I really need to find out like what all products they have, if they're sold anywhere else. I get this at Walmart. I don't know if they sell it anywhere else. So, if they do, check it out. See if there's anything you want to try, anything you like. I'll let you know how I feel about this at the end of the video. And if I leave it on long enough, I will let you know how much it holds up so like literally all this says on it is made in China distributed by cosmetic design group LLC discontinued irritation occurs lots of information there guys lots of information I know you feel really informed now don't you you know so I'm here for to inform you of nothing apparently 
Okay. Well, while I'm letting that kind of dry down, it doesn't feel tacky. The like kind of wet feeling, because um, it kind of started out almost oily feeling. It really kind of went away, which is nice. It doesn't feel tacky yet, but it kind of has that feel like it's gonna start feeling tacky. And I don't know if you like that. I personally like that. I like for my primers to have a tacky feel, so, you know. Speaking of primers that have a tacky feel, I'm about to put my primer on. Smashbox Primer Water because I love it. And my skin's going a little extra dry these days, so. So when we first got Primer Water in the store, I worked in a makeup store. When we first got it in the store, everybody was like, oh, it's like MAC, blah, blah, blah. And then all of our beauty obsessed customers would come in. You know what you have to talk about? The ones that are like, a new product comes out and they're like, oh, so and so on YouTube talked about this. I absolutely have to have it. Those. Um, they came in and they were like, oh, I saw that this is like MAC. I'm going to get this because where I'm at, um, up until like two years ago, the only place to get MAC was to drive like an hour away and even then it was in a department store and everybody was like, F that because the girls that work there were not usually helpful. Sorry if you work there and you know what I'm talking about, but they just weren't. So, they would be like, I'm not going to go get MAC and a lot of these people, they like to really touch it, play with it, so they're not going to order online because they want to have it right then and there. I don't blame them. I don't like to order online either because I like to have it right when I want it. I'm kind of impatient with that, so. Sorry. Um, but yeah, they would come in and they would try it and they'd be like, this is nothing like Mac. And my first response would always be like, you're right because Smashbox and Mac are not the same company. So they're not going to be the same thing. But Primer Water, long story short, um, if you want it to get that tacky feel, because it does take a while for it to get that way, um, spray it on and then kind of rub it. It almost like activates it. It just makes it faster. That's if you want that. You don't have to. I personally like that, so that's why I do it. I want to use a palette that I don't normally use a lot because I'm really kind of picky about what eyeshadows I wear and I have a lot of palettes that I just never wear because I'm like, oh, this is my favorite, but I got this eye primer and I really want to test it, to test its ability, so I'll go in with products and the only reason I don't like really reach for these is because if you don't have the right primer, if you don't have something to really make the shadows stay or pop, they just kind of disappear. And that's more than likely just my skin because my skin is weird and it like just eats pigment. I know that makes no sense to most people, but if you know me in real life, you know me in person, you know, you've seen it. I show a lot of people, because people used to not believe me, and I'd be like, I can't wear those products because the pigment disappears. They're like, no, you're just not doing it right. I'm like, no, it literally like disappears in my skin. Like it absorbs it. My skin absorbs the uh, pigment. Which is why I don't use a lot of the big name brands that people love because they just disappear on me. They're, they don't work for me okay. Do you. So we don't see how this one goes with this primer to see if it really holds it all in there, you know.
Your hair, your look, your everything When I see it all I knew that you were mine I'm in love with your hair, your lips Your silhouette in the moonlight shine With my love you won't ever be alone My summer love, been waiting for you my love You have my heart, you have my soul You have my whole, you have my control Love me tender, love me sweet With you I know that I'm complete I'm in love with the summer's day For you I'd give my life away Never leave me, never let me go My summer love, been waiting for you my love My summer love, been waiting for you my love My love is forever yours Stand on my own to feel again. I'll probably leave that part in there. It's been a while. Oh, sorry. Did I mess you up? Jesse, the look I just got. Just see the look I just got. Did you show your viewers your uh, mama mosa? I did. My mama mosa. Mama. Okay. It's like as big as my head. Like, <laughs> you see it? Damn. It's like as big as my head. This is a true mama so Can't wait till I have this baby and I can use that real alcohol in this. Great. Because I'm going to make it that size in that cup. And that's gonna be a daddy's in charge day. <laughs> I guess that means it's gonna be a Nana gets the baby day. Yes. <laughs> One time we get to have was mimosas and Latin Marys and Bud Lights and Coronas. When the baby's away. So, like, never. <laughs> yeah, that's true. <laughs> yeah.
probably gonna try out this new mascara. All right, what do you got? See if it's worth it at all. They're wet and wild. Both. Yep. Okay. Full healthy lashes. Uh huh. For volume, because I do uh -huh. volume first, because it makes them thick right there. Okay. Then mega length lengthening. Just makes them longer. We're gonna see how these work. The Mega Link says it's an improved formula. I don't need have to do two. I don't normally when I do more more expensive ones, the ones that I'm obsessed with, but I'm not about to put on my expensive makeup just to sit here for like an hour and then wash it off. Did you do all the trial from the wall when you got there? Mm -hmm. Usually all the stuff from the mm -hmm. So the first thing I tried was the eye primer. I mean, it looks like it held up pretty well. Looks like it held up pretty well. Yeah. I mean, I would say so. I use products that I don't normally use on my eyes because they like wear down and the color disappears. So like I use like the black that's out here is out of the Ulta palette and all the other colors are out of the Smashbox palette. I think you've seen me use this before and mm -hmm. like, you know, it just like disappears because my skin absorbs it all. So, I mean, the fact that you can still see the definition. That's good. I mean, I haven't had it on that long, but I mean, it's been like an hour. Mm -hmm. I almost put that on backwards. I almost did. No, that's right. This is the volumizing one. It lays on my mind. Yeah, because it says boost link. Yeah, this just doesn't normally, normally volumizing mascaras don't have a wand like that. Usually they're more like clumped together. See what happens. We'll see. Whoops, that goes another robbery. <sighs> oh, there goes the AC. Mm, that's not bad. I mean, mascara, no mascara, you can for sure see a difference. Okay, it went well. Mascara down. <laughs> I just love how I just model the mascara for my husband. I'm just, does it look good? Does it look good? Like, you can even tell anything when you blink that fast. <laughs> yes! Yes, queen! Yes! Work it, girl! Yes! <laughs> Y'all, if I didn't know, my husband's my biggest cheerleader ever. My yes, girl! Work it! He's my biggest supporter. I could be like, babe, I want to go shave my head and start a bald-headed movement. He'd be like, you know what? I'll support. I'll go be ahead. right there with you, girl. Shave my head. You can do too. it. We'll shave him at the same time. Yeah, like, girl, come on. Let's rock it! You know, it's pretty much down for anything. Like, he has so much faith in me. I love him. Well, as much as I've been despairing against, put somebody to spend with my wife. I'll kill him. Guys, do not repeat what I just said. Whoops, there goes another robbery. Danny DeVito. I need a veto. You want to play uh, uh, Penguin and Velma? Danny DeVito! Okay. 
Go. Off for me. Go what? Go. The real test is this eye. This is the one that always like yeah, freaks out with mascara. Yeah. She don't know how to jump, she claws me. Yeah. Sorry for my French guys. Okay. Oh, man. See like how long my lashes are now. you've seen them that long. It's been a hot minute. I forgot to show you guys the wand on this one. I do really like wands like that though. For like the tips. By the tips of the lashes. Because that way they don't apply too much. Because when you apply too much, like right on the tips, it like weighs them down and then they don't look like all fluttery. Punch you. you made me bleed. You made me draw blood. You typically never do that to me. She does it to me a lot. That's why I don't want her to jump on me anymore. Because she rode. Rode! Rode. And have a cup. Now I'm going to try out the setting spray. Alright, this is one of those 97 cent things that I got. It literally just says setting spray. Like it tells me nothing. So. And I see how this goes. So there's not really a strong smell or anything. So that's nice. Sometimes setting sprays can have like a super intense smell to them. It's not like a super fine mist, but it's not horrible. It's good. To makeup, huh? Then I'm more into makeup than football, so just be proud that I've heard the name before and uh, that I knew it was football. Good job, babe. Yeah, just be proud of that because I can't say there's much more to be proud of with that. No, 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 I've heard that name before too. Isn't that a wide receiver? Yep. See, I at least knew that. Well, let's see what we're on. Larry Fitzgerald? Nope. Well, let's see what four of his own cardinals. Man, 
Le'Veon Bell? No idea. Huh? No idea. Running back for Jets? Mm. You probably never heard of this guy, Antonio Brown. I've heard that name. <laughs> I've heard that one. Um, I don't actually know who he is, but I've heard the name. He's a wide receiver. Mm. Well, I, I don't know if the things I said to him or not. I don't know. I think nobody picked him up yet. Oh, was he a free agent? Mm-hmm. Went, See, I know what that is. Went from Steelers to LA Ra uh, Raiders. Yeah. Well, it was open right before it became. Yeah, it sounded different. Oh, ice cream trucks here. Yep. Yeah. Ice cream, ice cream, ice it's cream. Ten again. I would say I want some, but I feel like it's kind of dull right now. I don't know. It depends on what they have. One of these days, we need to go out there and see what they have. Oh, it'd be here probably every day or. Yeah, over the summer. Well, especially because since they canceled school for the rest of the year, probably be out here every freaking day. Mm -hmm. Definitely gonna be at home third. <laughs> it's payday. It's Friday. Well, I mean, yeah, but I'm saying, like, going forward, like, in future months. Yep. Okay. Um, other than the fact that this is, like, a lot of makeup, and I really, truly hate wearing this amount of makeup. Like, I know you can see it's, like, caked on. I truly hate wearing this amount of makeup. I mean, it looks good on camera. I just hate wearing it. But other than that, like, everything seems good. I don't know if the setting spray really did anything, but it didn't leave like gaping spots. I've had some before that's like really cheap, like two, three dollars, and I would spray it and then you could see exactly where the dots hit. Mm. So it didn't do that, so that's a plus. It's a big plus. It's a good thing. No, what the hell is that? The lip product that I'm like struggling to get out of this freaking box right now. Golly. No, they did it. not want that to come out. Okay. This is the matte lip cream in I don't know the shade. There's like not a shade on here. Oh, there we go. Fireball. This is coming out like more pink on camera than it is, but it's actually like red. It's like a bright red. Like an, an orange based red. Those typically look better on me than the others. My lips pull really pink naturally. So if if the color has like any pink in it, it pulls just straight pink. So when I go for reds, I typically go for these. These are also called blue based reds. But a lot of people get real confused when you say that. So I just say they're an orangey red. I'm going to be real brave and try this with no liner. It went on pretty well. I had some issues right around the top right here. You can see it's still not even. And then when I went to go put it on the bottom, like, on this weird, like, dry string came out. But, I mean, for a dollar. i definitely say the lip. I really like. It's even. It's not, like, too drying. Like, it's dry, but it's a matte product, so you kind of expect that. But it's not, like, super drying. I really like it. No transfer. That's awesome. And I really just put this on. So, like, dry time is great. Color. I definitely like the color. You know, I love me a red lip. And I'm out of all my red lips, so definitely a good replacement with this one. I would say I like these better than the um, Wet n Wild. The Wet n Wild were a good, like, alternative for me to my Stila, because my Stila is my all-time favorite. But the Wet n Wild was a good alternative, but this one just, I, mm -hmm. see the Wet n, this is the Wet n Wild one, and then this one. I don't know what the size difference is. So, point 
two ounces and 0 0.08. So I mean, size wise is a big difference, but I mean, these are like three dollars. Sometimes four, it just depends on what store you're at. And nice ounces. Like I can do nice ounces all day long. Um, eye primer. I'm really, I'm not mad at it. Like, I'm not mad at it. I like that. I would say, yeah, to the air eye primer. The spray. Like I said, I don't know that I noticed a difference, but. This I'll have to try again. I just totally dropped that. <laughs> I'll definitely have to try this again um, on a day when I do my makeup, like at the beginning of the day. And I'll purposefully use a product that doesn't last more than a couple hours and see if this helps to extend it. Because that would be a, a good test for that. Okay, so first review of them, great. Maybe I'll do that. Maybe I'll do like a, a wear test one day. Sounds fair. Sounds reasonable. Okay. So thanks for joining me on this adventure to recreate makeup that I just really haven't done in a long time. Uh, and try out these new products. I kind of want to get some more. Like, they had blush and eyeshadow and eyeliners. Um, I may have to go back and get some of those. If my husband will let me. Like I said, I don't know the one, I don't know the one that you're here to get it on the recording. I just swiped the card. Yeah, I don't know if you guys heard that, but he definitely, he said that in the store today. And there were a couple people that looked like, what? But he said that earlier because I was asking him in the store. I was like, do you think this looks better or this looks better? And he was like, the makeup is all you. I just swiped the card. <laughs> Thanks, babe. That's my most but don't, awesome. don't let him fool you. He does a lot more than that. Anytime I put on a product, I go up to him and I'm like, does this look good? Do you like it? But. All right. Thanks for tuning in, guys. Be sure to like, subscribe, comment. Um, let me know what else you want to see from us. Still working to get Koss over here uh, to do some videos. He's got a couple in mind that he wants to do. I just got to get him to do them. Once he does, I have a feeling you guys will love him. Uh, I love him. Yahas! How could you not love that? Alright. Peace out from the Venom guys. See ya! Peace.